Instead, I become something more. A storyteller, a troubadour, a dispenser of thought and action. A creative bonding agent that catalyzes. Riddle me reactive. Plumbing unlimited love for art and its finer crafts. Technical, commercial, independent, off the beaten path to provocation. I require no moniker. I request no artificial self-satisfaction. But I yearn to self-start as the snare drum kicks in and the bass guitar walks its notes. My canvas is mural size. My mind completely elastic. A renaissance in a rubber band. Needing no aid to escalate. If I'm not a poet, do I transform into something wholly new? Is this prophecy fulfilled? At my best when producing art for the sake of grasping of the foothills of knowledge and skill. Gratification, my co-pilot, but not my wingman. Signature on the dotted line, steeped in serendipity, as asynchronous watches suddenly synchronize. Soothsayer of the soul, must retain my victory lap past the finish line, extending my final ride as greater and purveyor. No salt in the wounds, crystal saline distilled all over this body, hugging the valleys of hills. Needing no henchmen to carry out my bidding, for there's still much impurity littering this landscape. As a writer, I unsheath brandish weapons as I take aim at oblivion and apathy, striking both down with lethal force. A new reckoning. Revealing wolves in sheep's clothing, exposing callous indoctrination by providing welcoming alternatives. Minds of youth need molding, minds of elders need refreshing, pruning, reshaping in order to adapt or to become archaic fountains of youth, use ideas with strategized implementation society benefits the world continues spinning its axis rotating rhythmically recuperation a written word away